dear students today i am going to explain to you cbc 12th class physics this uh, this questionnaire is j entrance examination it's a revision question paper and solutions let us start now first uh, this topic which i took here is wave optics we can do some questions in wave optics question answer part 1 so it's a series of question pap question paper and solution so in the part 1 we have 12 questions you can go through this question and answers here okay let us start now principles of superposition path difference and wave fronts and coherence these are the covering in this section here first question two coherent sources of light can be obtained by there are four options you can find the answer the coherent source cannot be obtained from two different light sources and let us see the second question by corpuscular theory of light the phenomena which can be explained is refraction interference and uh, diffraction polarization so in light theory you know there are two basic theories one is corpuscular and the huygens theory by the corpuscular theory which phenomena is explained here the answer is diffraction so next question is two coherent monochromatic light beams of intensities i and 4i are superposed the maximum and minimum possible intensities in the resulting beams are 5i and i five here some option is there so you can find the answer you can see here how the maximum and minimum intensities resulting beams so suppose i i1 and i2 are the two intensities then i resultant sorry uh, i resultant equal to i1 plus i2 plus 2 root of i1 i2 into into cos theta here the value of cos theta cos zero equal to one and cos ninety equal to zero cos ninety equal to zero so this will be the maximum and this will be the minimum so using this one you can see this is i max is equal to this one and i minimum is equal to this one after solving these questions you can get nan i plus i uh, i minimum is equal to i so the answer will be this one 
okay the next question is idea of quantum nature of light has emerged in an attempt to explain which one here the answer is 3 according to the Planck's hypothesis black bodies emit radiation in the form of photos okay next one is fifth similar the similarity between the sound waves and light waves are here what are the sim which one the similarities you can find the similarities here the answer is for they can produce interference both can induce interference sound waves and light waves okay next question if you if the amplitude ratio of two sources producing interference 3 is to 5 the ratio of intensities at the maxima and minima is that is 3 16 go. maxima minima we are finding this equation a1 by a2 here maxima i maxima divided by minima is equal to using this equation you can find the value it it will be 16 by 1 okay next question is 7 for consecutive interference to take place between two monochromatic light waves of wavelength the path difference should be from here the answer will be n lambda for consecutive interference path difference is even multiples of lambda by 2 so lambda lambda by 2 lambda by even multiples okay next question is which of the following statements are if statements indicate that light waves are transverse in the in this statement statement 3 light waves can be polarized and be polarized okay next is ninth question the ratio of amplitude of interfering waves is 3 is to 4 now the ratio of their intensities will be 3 that is 9 by 16 here is the formula I directly proportional to a square here you can see using this 9 by 16 we will get 9 by 16 so it will be 3 next tenth question wave front of a wave has direction with the wave motion perpendicular wave motion perpendicular here perpendicular next is the similarity between sound waves and light waves the answer is 4 they can produce interference sound wave and light wave both can produce interference next twelfth question dual nature of light is exhibited by photo electric cell photo electric effect here refraction and uh, diffraction and refraction refraction and the photo here the fourth question is uh, the answer is fourth one diffraction and the photo electric effect diffraction shows the wave nature of light and the photo electric effect shows the nature of the light Thank you.